49er defense to try to stop Dick Bass. A tough assignment with a first down and goal at the six yard line. Gabriel. Here comes Bass. He scores. Five foot ten, 200 pounds, power packed runner from Vallejo and the University of Pacific, Dick Bass. It's late in the second period as Ram quarterback Frank Ryan pitches out to Dick Bass, who hammers out 18 yards before he runs into his own man plus defensive halfback Jack Morris. Third quarter gets off to a fast and furious start with Dick Bass taking a second down pitch for a ride around the left side. With downfield blocking paving the way, Bass bounds away on a 73-yard explosion that rocks Metropolitan Stadium. It's a new game with a score knotted at 21-21. First down at 10 at the 10-yard line. Here's a fine call by Gabriel. A counter trap faking the 49er right defensive line. Look to your left now as you look over the Los Angeles Rams offense. There's the hole. Touchdown. <laughs> and an interception by Abe Woodson. He gets up and goes 51 yards. But there is the speedy bass. A rally Woodson. Billy Wade engineers a rally late in the game. Billy scampers around until Dick Bass gets loose. His pass is high, but Bass makes a great stab for a 26-yard game. Dick Bass supplied much of the Los Angeles legwork in 1963. In the 1716 squeaker over the Colts, Dick breaks free for 51 yards to set up a Ram touchdown. One of our favorite varieties is the Sawed Off Bass. His first name is Richard. Number 22 has his own particular style of running. A favorite sight for Dick Bass fans is that of the scooter disappearing into a pile of players and all at once come burrowing out the other side. It's much like a gopher at work in the garden. Among Dick's assets are quickness, a low center of gravity, which gives him deceptive power and that subtle change of pace. The running game was sparked by these men. That's Tom Moore, Dick Bass in front, Jim Steiger and Les Josephson behind But them. in 1966, undoubtedly, the man of the year for the Rams was Dick Bass. While you watch number 22 in three plays, let's check his season. Early in the year, Bass became the most productive runner in Ram history as he passed Deacon Dan Towler's record of 3,493 yards. Bass gained 1,090 yards in 1966 to break his own single season record and his blocking graded highly too. But the eyes, not words, are the way you appreciate the noblest motor scooter of them all. Watch the blocking that makes this play work. First guard, Shabelli, comes out of the line and cuts down a man. Then Iman is in the right spot, and the runner moves behind his block. Finally, Josephson adds a few extra yards with a nifty bit of work. Second period, Dick Bass started Los Angeles off again with a 28-yard scamper down the sideline. Roman Gabriel finding his receiver is covered. Nose dived into the end zone to give the Rams a lead they never surrendered. Quarterback Roman Gabriel threw no interceptions while completing 17 of 23 passes for four touchdowns. And Dick Bass added more gold to his crown by becoming the first Ram ever to rush over 5,000 yards in his career. 
have done it in a blur of action that filled NFL parks Sunday after Sunday. To the air game was added a solid running attack, guided by the skittering runs of nine-year veteran Dick Bass. fashioned kind of excitement that made the 1968 Rams unique and hopes for the future bright. Bass gets the offense rolling with this 21-yard gallop. The year of the Rams. At the start of the final period, Dick Bass squirms for a nine-yard gain. Excellent play-action faking by Gabriel precedes a pass to Bass for a first down at the 15. Needing one yard for a first down, Dick Bass gets two, and it's goal to go, Los Angeles. As Dick Bass skirts the Cowboy flank for five yards. Then tears up the middle to the Dallas 26. Two key blocks paved the way for Gabriel. Dick Bass provides the first. And Tom Mack the second as Gabriel catapults into the end zone. Dick Bass jukes by number 21, Dick Daniels, and streaks for the touchdown that turned the game into a rout, 35 to 13. Bass gained more than 1,000 yards in 1966. This year, he appears headed for another sparkling season. For Dick Bass and the Rams, it's been a glorious Texas afternoon. The Rams' offense, wrecked by injury and often marked by sluggish play this season, was resuscitated in the third quarter by Dick Bass, number 22. On two determined runs by the little scooter, they moved inside the giant 20. 14 to 7. The Bass on the screen. Dick Bass. Scoots for 10 yards, another first down. The rush is on, but he hits Bass. To Dick Bass. Now it's second and 10 in the 14. Again, Bass gets the call. Rams ball, second and four. Dick Scooter Bass having a great year. Six yards and a first down. Bob Boyd, one of the tacklers. Again, Gabriel setting up the screen pass to Bass. Good run by Bass. Dick Bass breaks a tackle, gets into the end zone, and it's now Rams 14, Bears 10. Looking for a receiver. Finds his safety valve, Dick Bass. And Bass goes for 11 yards. Bass on the draw. Thirty-one yards and a first down. Dick Bass, number 22, had a good day as the nine-year veteran scored three touchdowns. Superb blocking and great desire were the keys to this fine touchdown run. By game's end, Bass had pushed his career yardage total over the 5,000 mark. Four plays later, Bass puts the Rams back on top in the seesaw contest. shows how the National Football League's smallest fullback powers for touchdown. We resume the action story late in the third quarter as Bass nears the all-time record. He gets even closer by running 15 yards after a heads-up lateral from Gabriel. Here's the historic yard. It's 3,494. Pretty good mileage, even from a motor scooter. Now the end zone camera catches the magic talents of Bass as he scores his third and the Rams' final touchdown of the night. Final score, Rams 34, 49ers 3. And it is the biggest night for Dick Bass in seven Rams seasons. Three touchdowns plus a new all-time rushing record.